Well, we got some breeze. I don't know how much. But I figured we might as well give old Gray Matter City one more spin. It's been giving up some tickets, you know. Maybe there'll be a gold one out here today. Ha! There's some Gray Matter. Or maybe it'll be sanded in again. You can't ever tell. It changes. Oh, it is kind of breezy. I don't like I like it. Stand by a minute. It's too breezy, I think. It's too breezy for me, I mean. Northwest about 12. It don't look too bad that way. Stand by. I wanted to try out too. Las Vegas. Low Tide Tim was on holiday for a week. Carried his wife to Las Vegas for their 50th wedding anniversary in Sedona, Arizona. They went to Sedona. I'm going to try this baby out, see how it works. I can hunt along the edge of the damp sand, okay. I just don't like hunting on the edge of the damp sand too much. It looks halfway workable down there by the bridge. <clears throat> I got to make up my mind. It's just too damn rough right here. For me, I mean. <coughs> well, we're trying it. We moved down a little bit from where we were. They're not crashing right here as bad as they were back there. So we're about what? five feet off the beach, four feet. So far, no targets. I got a shout out to a guy from Cape Town, South Africa. It's Sean, his name is Sean. Sean, I don't know, you know, probably don't know this guy, but there's a hell of a knife sharpener in Cape Town. His, his, uh, his uh, trade name is Mad Rookie. He don't sharpen for money, he just sharpens for himself, but he sharpens really fancy pocket knives and kitchen knives. Mad rookie. Check him out. Sean from Cape Town, South Africa. I'll see you, buddy. Take it easy. It fell through. This is a shaky, but sounding good. A two and a three. A two and a three. Just crap-ass aluminum. This is a 14, 15, 16. Might be a bottle cap. Or it might be nothing. I got a rock in here. Looks like a, I don't think it's, I don't think it's that. Let's find out. Nope, not that. We'll try another scoop of See what we can get. I know it's rough this way. I 
Oh, I see it. Looks like a piece of tire. I mean, a stem off a car. Way we got a solid 13. Brass copper wire or something. It fell through right there. You see it, 10? See that 10? Look at it. Boy, it sounds great. It's gonna fall through again, I got a feeling. We got it. Oh, it fell through again. Okay, there goes the neighborhood. I moved off the beach about 30 feet. That way I'm not right there in the crash zone. I'm just in the rollies. Where they roll over me, into me. They're not crashing. See them coming? Look at them. God, it's too rough today. They're crashing up there bad. Here they come, rollies. I hate them. Many targets. I'm getting discouraged early, fast. No gray matter yet. Oh. It's getting too rough for me. I ain't finding anything. Uh, I'm getting near my debarkation point. So I'm going to take a left here in a minute and go to hell back to Rancho Max. Got an iffy sound here. And that's all it is. Good gracious me, waves. I don't know. Uh. To the slope. We got a five here or a seven, I can't remember what it was. Aluminum. What's going on here today? That wave. Somebody wanted to know what this was. He said the tree next to the house. It's a black dragon, cryptomere, Japanese cedar. And it's grown probably five, five or six foot since we've had it. Started that down just about where my coil is. And it's grown that much. But well, we've had it for uh, 
not long, maybe uh, six years, maybe. Maybe seven years, but I don't think so. But it does pretty good. She's trimmed it off in the middle here for some reason. She did that herself, but not the top part. And I don't know why that either. Okay. I'm home from the land of Bleaksville. No new age tickets today. No nothing today. I got to deliver some knives. Get ready for the afternoon farmer's market. I'll get back to you. Well, it was a slow treasure day. But it sure sounds like it's going to be a ripper knife day. I got to pick up some knives from a lady not far from where I picked up the knives at yesterday in East Beach. And a guy from Hampton, which is about 30 miles away, he's going to bring me a whole block of knives. I forgot whether he said they were Wustoffs and Hankles. He said it's an 18-piece block. That's a gathering of knives. I don't know, I don't know what I'm picking up. I have to put that on, a, on my knife video from to, from today. This won't be on air. But it's gonna be a ripper knife day. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Mumbles man came around a little while later, and he said it got a little calmer. He he hung around and found uh, what you see here. He says he's going to the land of Nada tomorrow. I uh, I may try that too. I have to see how my schedule looks. I'll get back to you. Good luck to everybody.